So today I'm going to introduce the microstructure properties relations in the quench and the partitioning steel. And it's kind of uh, advanced uh, steel uh, recently. And uh, this is uh, my uh, palm part index. And I, saw, uh, I, I divide the whole palm part into six parts. The introduction, the production process of the steel and the Microsoft structure and the application, the research design and other ones advantage and disadvantage. And the introduction, uh, quench and the partition steel is known as the Q and P steels. And uh, as, I, as I have mentioned above, it's very advanced steel uh, used in the uh, automotive industrial. And uh, uh, currently, uh, the cost of this material is a little bit higher than the normal material. So maybe people want to find out uh, how can how can we save the cost of this material? And uh, this material has a very good property with high strength and uh, critical uh, ductility elongation. And, uh, and, uh, and uh, uh, through this research, uh, here is my research problem. How can this new alloy used in application? Uh, what I'm saying is that what is the cost of the material? What is the parameter of the materials? And so on. And uh, here is the way how can people product these uh, materials so this production process and uh, it's pro process by the quench and the partition uh, partitioning process firstly uh, we, uh, we will put the steel in a quench process uh, what is the meaning of quench is the, the steel uh, a rapid cooling uh, quench means that rapid cooling array and uh, uh, through this quench process we can achieve the microstructure properties of the uh, microstructure of the austenite and the bainite and the retained austenite oh and martensite so uh, uh, which can uh, increase the strength of the steel and the ductilities and uh, it also can uh, uh, refine the grain structure uh, which means that it can increase the dislocation densities of the steel and it can improve the uh, hardness of the steel uh, so, uh, partitioning process. Uh, what is partitioning process? It keeps the temperature higher or equal uh, than the uh, quench, uh, quenching temperature, uh, which means that it's like the mountain size star temperatures. And uh, it also can in enrich the carbon content, uh, which means that it may uh, slightly decrease the strength of the material, but it can improve the ductility of the material significantly. And uh, it also, so as, uh, as I have mentioned, it can balance the strength and ductilities. And uh, it also can increase the uh, retaining austenite, it's the same. Uh, so as I have mentioned, there, there are three uh, main kinds of microstructure in the, this kind of alloy. Uh, mountain size, uh, bainite, and retaining austenite. And uh, uh, how can we get these three uh, kind of different microstructure is through the Cooling rate. Cooling rate will uh, uh, in, uh, depend on uh, can uh, process this kind of three different microstructure. And uh, this is the, the the picture of the the, the picture of the microstructure in the micro microscope. And as 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 we can see that the microstructure of the mountain side and is is very. Uh, very small and uh, which means that the dislocation density is very high so it can increase hardness so the higher uh, the, the cooling rate uh, like the, the faster the quench process uh, we use so we can get the mountain side and the bay light so uh, here is the main application of the uh, of the of this uh, new materials uh, it normally used in the automotive in automotive structure part, like it can it, because it has the high strength and the uh, suitable ductility, so uh, it's very safe for car. And uh, it also ha can decrease the fuel consumption. And and this is the problem that I wonder because I check a lot of research that the uh, the research mentioned it can decrease the fuel of consumption. But how can this material decrease the Field of consumption, and this is the problem that I need to find out in the in my research. So, uh, so 
So, uh, as I have mentioned, so I have de uh, designed the research to find out some problem that I have tracked. So, firstly, I'm going to research what kind of parameter needed in the automotive industry. Uh, for this process, I will, I will buy some uh, buy some structural part of automotive uh, cars. Uh, so, I will test this kind of uh, different kind of parameter in the laboratory. Uh, in, I think it, uh, so we can we can check out. So secondly, I'm going I'm going to I'm going to find out the cost of this kind of material. But uh, for this process, it may have some disadvantage because uh, because uh, as we uh, as we know the the cost of the material in the laboratory is much more higher than the cost of the material in the in the industrial. And thirdly, I will investigate which part of automotive material may mostly use in uh, in this uh, of this material. As I mentioned, the structural part may be the most uh, may be used, but no uh, no no research mentioned it. So I, I can find out and I can find out through investigate the the steel manufacturing companies or or the automotive uh, in, uh, company. But I need to get the assess. Firstly, how can this uh, new material decrease the fuel consumption? Maybe, I, I guess it's lightweight or whatever, so I will find out. I will search the parameter, maybe the weight of this material is is, little, is lighter than the weight of normal materials used in the automotive industrial or the fuel consumption industrial, and uh, I, will, I will find out in the laboratory. So, according to a trip, uh, so there are some advantage and disadvantage of this uh, of my research. Firstly, uh, I think I get the information from the the information which I achieve in the laboratory to be very accurate. So I can I can learn a lot of knowledge that I have learned in the in the university. So so I can put the knowledge uh, we have learned in the practical use, uh, which can really help me a lot. So. It also have some disadvantage, disadvantage of this research uh, because uh, as we have mentioned we need to buy the automotive part uh, material and the cost of the material may be very high so uh, that, that, uh, we lack of the initial fund and uh, the cost of the material calculation might not be very accurate because I, uh, the, the cost of the material in the labora laboratory is much more higher than the cost of the material in industrial use because in my, uh, so maybe uh, it also have some like uh, we, we will check some information from the internet uh, which may be very ac uh, accurate uh, because uh, just uh, we just check this kind of information in the website so that's all of my uh, presentation thank